all about the clap back. Get your boss whack, premieres funeral on Snapchat. Ha! You now tuned into the bad guy. The sky's gray, it's like this every day The town is full of bread, a little turn, a little prey I flip a million out of nothing, make them feel a certain way Hoping that the switch What's good y'all, Fist Vegas, the hardest voice of sports Go ahead, hit that like button and subscribe to the Fist You know why you at it Y'all know what time it is If you ain't with it, you best get with it Now let's rock Listen I want to talk about Mahomes versus Tom Brady and what the winner has to benefit from this Super Bowl because Tony Romo came out and said that if Mahomes doesn't beat Brady in the Super Bowl, he can't pass him. And I'm going to be honest with you, I 1000% agree. I don't care if Mahomes goes and wins eight Super Bowls. If he loses to Tom Brady in this Super Bowl head to head, I can't call him better than Brady because they played head to head. If he loses to Brady a second time in a Super Bowl, listen, this is the second Mahomes Brady Super Bowl. When they played in the AFC Championship game, that's a Super Bowl. You know, y'all, y'all, y'all don't get it. When Mahomes and Brady played in the playoffs, the two times they played, the biggest game they could play in was the AFC Championship game because they was both in the they were both in the AFC so that's their Super Bowl we all knew the winner of that game was gonna beat the damn Rams that was like having a ladder match it was like Brady versus Mahomes in a ladder match the winner gets the right to, to play Jared Goff are you, are you serious it was like hanging Jared Goff at the top of the ladder in a WWE match and they fighting for the contract to play Jared Goff like come on man whoever won that game was gonna win the Super Bowl and now they're in the Super Bowl versus each other this is the second time they're playing in a, an important playoff game. Mahomes got to win this because he can't be 0 for 2 versus Tom Brady in important playoff wins and ever expect anybody, especially me, to think he's better than him. Y'all know how I am. Jordan and Michael never played against each other. Montana and Brady never played against each other. So when you get an opportunity to see Mahomes versus Brady, or Peyton Manning versus Tom Brady, or Aaron Rodgers versus Tom Brady. I'm, I don't care if Aaron Rodgers. What? How many rings Aaron Rodgers wins? I'm not gonna forget him losing head to head versus Brady. I can't do that. The only exception I make is LeBron versus KD, because in the, in, the, in basketball, dudes be building super teams. That shit don't count. It don't count. Dudes be building super teams. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm sorry. Like, cut it out. That don't count. But at the end of the day, when it comes to football, I saw Peyton Manning beat Tom Brady in three AFC title games. You can't tell me. I don't care if Tom Brady won five more Super Bowls. You're not telling me he's better than Peyton Manning. Because as far as I'm concerned, all I got to do is just go get Peyton Manning in a competent team, and he'll beat Tom Brady. This is prime Tom Brady with Bill Belichick. This is prime Rob Gronkowski, prime Julian Edelman. Peyton Man to whoop that ass three times on two different franchises. Peyton Man was down 18 points to Tom Brady in 2006, came back and beat him. Y'all make all them 28 to 3 jokes, well, Peyton Man was down 21 3. What happened? So, you know, if Mahomes loses to Brady, he could never be the GOAT. It can't happen. Mahomes can never be the GOAT if he loses to Tom Brady in this Super Bowl. He can't be it. I put a lot of stock in the head-to-heads. Once again, the only one I disclaim is the Kevin Durant shit. That, that's, no, that don't count. But you know why I gave Steph Curry credit? You know why I always put Steph Curry ahead of Damian Lillard? Because guess what? When Klay Thompson was healthy... Even when KD was not there, Curry and Clay was whooping that ass. Even before Kevin Durant got there, Curry and Clay was whooping that ass against James Harden. They was whooping that ass against um Damian Lillard. They was whooping that ass. We all know Kevin Durant got hurt in in um in the Western Conference Championship. We saw we saw Clay and Curry take it to Damian CJ. We saw that shit. 
We saw Steph and Clay down 3-1 to Oklahoma City and came back and won. We saw how many times they smack um, James Harden without Kevin Durant in the playoffs. Remember James Harden looking for his mouthpiece at the end of the game? That was against the Warriors. So I always give that. I will always give that to Curry. He head to head in the playoffs, even without KD, he whooped that ass. So you have to take these things into consideration, people. You can't just sit here and say, oh, well, Brady got six rings. So he's better than everybody. No. We got to look at these head-to-head matchups when we can. So when I look at Mahomes, Mahomes, you playing for your GOAT title. Because I got news for you, Mahomes. If you can beat Tom Brady in this Super Bowl, right? You're, it's going to take, I say three. You got to get three. It's going to take you about, nah, well, you know, I'm going to be honest with you. Yeah, he got to. Damn, I don't know, man. This he might you might be able to make some goat conversations with Mahomes. Cause my rule is two. You gotta have two to be my goat. I cause I I feel like this. One Super Bowl was a fluke. Nick Foles got a Super Bowl. Joe Flacco got a Super Bowl. Russell Wilson got a Super Bowl. One Super Bowl is a fluke. Now anybody can get one. Brett Favre got one. Breeze and Rogers got one. Never went back. So one Super Bowl is a fluke. Can you get two? Can you get three? I'm not going to play the ring game because I think that's bullshit. That's the easy way out. Big Fist don't play the ring game. I have two eyes. I'm going to judge you based on how I see you. And, it, and if I see Tom Brady lose to Peyton Manning in three title games, I'm not putting him above Peyton Manning. <laughs> It's like putting John Elway above Joe Montana. It's blasphemous. It's blasphemous. You can't, I don't care how much better you think John Elway may be. John Elway may be a better quarterback than, than Joe Montana. But when they played head-to-head, Joe Montana put his fucking foot up John Elway ass. That's how this shit go. You got to put... When it, what are you doing head-to-head? I don't care what you do against other teams. What you do when you see me. When I'm in your face, what you do. Bottom line. That's how this goes. But I ain't got nothing else to say, man. That's it. That's all. Subscribe to the unit if you rock it with me. My name is Fist Vegas, and I approve this message.